Well, hello there, it's Red Knight here, and welcome back to a really interesting video for my Heyday collection and for your enjoyment. Now, as you know, I do love frogs and I enjoy singing a beautiful frog song sometimes. But I got shown how to do something really cool in my last stream, and I'm going to teach you all how to do that now. Because like I was like, oh my god, it's wonderful, and I so loved it. I got so excited by the fact that I can now capture frogs. And that's what I'm going to do. Now what I've got here is a large open area and I've been told by the person that it really works well if you have this larger open space to start with. So what I'm going to do first of all is to place down some brick wall. Now this brick wall will be my nice little capture area. So I'm going to place the wall down like I'm doing here. Add a few more of those pieces in and then bring it down and around. So luckily I've got quite a few stored up there so it's not going to be too much of a problem when it comes to the actual quantities. I should have plenty in storage there. Now creating a nice little capture area for my little froggies. This is going to be so awesome. I'm going to be so happy about this because I do love those frogs. And I wonder how many of those frogs can I actually get? We're going to have to find out and see. Now I am basically working my wall around at the moment. I'm not going to go completely over the whole of the area because I want to be able to blend it in a little bit later with the actual trees I've got in this area as well. So, but I'm almost done now anyway. And here we go, the last few pieces are adding in there. And then there we go, a couple more there and then we are almost done done. I'm so looking forward to this. So a nice little staggered approach there as well. Okay, so there's my frog area. Now to capture frogs you're going to need water. So the best option is to come along to your actual vouchers. Scroll on down until you find the ponds. Now I've got the large pond here and I'm going to bring the large pond into this area like so. Now get away with that one. Now what I've got here is a large pond and zero frogs at the moment. In fact if you look around my farm you'll see that there's basically no frogs at all within my actual farm itself. They've all disappeared and there's just none there at all. Well I'm going to change that now. I'm going to introduce frogs back into my farm location. Now to do that I need to tap on the actual pond many many times and then it will introduce those frogs to my farm. So here we go. Ready? Tap 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 and here they come. They are bouncing out of the back there and oh my goodness me will you look at those. So we are now getting frogs everybody. Frogs they are spawning. Oh my goodness me. That is so awesome. Look at them go. Look at them go. They are joining my little farm area. I can't believe this. I've got frogs. And I keep tapping, 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 tapping. And more and more come. And they keep coming. And oh my god, this is so fantastic. Now some of them will go back in. Now as long as I keep tapping here, they will keep adding and adding and adding. However, if I do stop, then the numbers should decrease, especially if I start tapping again. So tapping, tapping, tapping away keeps adding them to my actual trap area. Now I'm going to stop here. So I've stopped now. I've got lots of frogs there. I'm very, very pleased. They're jumping into the water. They're disappearing. So what I need to do is to move that out of the way. Now if I move that out of the way as such, so let me just stick it down here for the moment. Now I've got a large area down here. Now actually this area doesn't work. So be, me tapping on it here you can see that it's not a good area. So it has to be within your actual farm itself. So there you go. All of those little frogs are captured. I now have my little frogs entrapment area and I can sing to my frogs very very nicely whenever I wanted to. And I'm so pleased about that one. Now if you decide you don't want the frogs, okay all you've got to do is just put it back there let it go again and tap it again and then basically they start disappearing back into the actual water and then the number of frogs will decrease. In fact if you move it around and then you start tapping they will follow you as well and that's super super awesome and I like that one. So brilliant if I do say so. Well let's put my pond back in the area. I got my frogs, I'm happy. There you go little froggies disappear back into the water and they are all vanishing. So to add frogs Add the pool, tap it, they come. To remove the frogs, put the water back, tap it again, and then they will disappear. And then basically you end up with an area with zero frogs. Come on, little froggy, get in that water, disappear. You're the last one. Oh my god, I got one outside my area as well. And there we go. They have all vanished. Yeah, super cool. I like that one. 
Now that pleases me greatly. So I have no frogs left in my entrapment area. Let's do that one more time. So we move it back up again and we bring it up into the little area like so. Put it down in the middle and let's see if it works. Now because I've just tapped it and I've got rid of them, maybe tapping again will bring them back. Yes, here we go. Look, there they come. They're coming back. So come on little froggies, out you come. Come and play with me. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, out you come, out you come. Stop playing around. Get out of that water. That's it. Tap, 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 tap. I like it. Here they come. They're spawning now. Yes, and we are doing it again. Super, super, super awesome. This is absolutely fantastic, and I so love this. So, capture your frogs, show me your designs, and let me see them, everybody. I would so love to see all of your frogs like I've got here. Bring them to me, show it to me, and let me have a look. And there we go. The frogs are trapped. Now, I like that one. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, right, that's me, Red Knight, signing off. I hope you like this little video. Now, I would like to say thank you, thank you very much to the person who showed me how to do this. This is absolutely awesome, and this is your methodology, and I'm going to name the video after you. So, the title will be named after the owner of this creation method, and I adore you for it. Right. But either way, I'm signing off, and I will see you all next time. So, have a happy heyday, enjoy catching your frogs, and goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.